Hi, thanks for watching this video. Today I'm just going to show you some of the 2022 advent calendars. I've bought these quite early this year, but I just wanted to show you what is available. That is best to buy these early because they always sell out. That's always disappointing and they don't want to have to pay double or more online just because someone's bought a ton of these early and they're trying to make some money and just rip people off. You just don't want that either. So get them early. But today we're gonna to kick this off with the Lego Star Wars Advent Calendar. There's a classic Hoth theme going on here and there's eight minifigures. As you can see here, the Clone Trooper Commander and the Battle Droid. There's quite a few mini builds included too and also quite a rare Snow Trooper there as well. And also on the right hand side there's Luke hanging upside down in the Wamba Cave which is one of the most famous scenes from the Empire Strikes Back. There's Darth Vader, C-3PO and R2-D2 all in festive jumpers and Darth Vader's got flippers on. <laughs> Next up we have the Jurassic World Dominion advent calendar and there's 19 minis in here. These are the mini figures or mini dinosaurs you get in the blind boxes and blind bags. But in total there's 30 surprises or 30 pieces. And they're definitely not going to disappoint, but we'll find out about this later, so stay tuned for that. But next up we have the Mini Brands Advent Calendar, and this is a collection of the most favourite Mini Brands items over the years. I'm not sure if they're going to be the same in every box. There's 90 Mini Brand items to collect, but there's 24 obviously here. But again, stay tuned and you'll find out about those also. Next up is the Minecraft Advent Calendar. Again, there's 24 surprises. There's a few minifigures here, there's Steve dressed up there for the festive season with his jumper and trousers, and there's a few other mobs too. There's a couple of Christmas hats there that fit on the characters' heads. There's a few accessories too for your scenery, and also there's some cardboard scenery to pop out and build so you can take your characters for a festive stroll. And next up we have the Schlage Dinosaur Advent Calendar, it looks like we might get some baby dinosaurs, and lots of good bits and pieces. I can see a couple of my favourite dinosaurs there already. And also this year's calendar is a little more eco-conscious as we can see here. Toy companies are quite big on plastic so it's good to see they're playing their part these days. That code there will scan later so please stay tuned for that. There's a lot to see on the back of this box but that's not all included here. These are just things that are available. But next up we have the Pokemon Holiday Calendar. Quite a strange shape to this one. But it does fold out into a regular sized advent calendar. And this one has 25 doors to open so that's a little bit extra special this year. And as I can see on the side of the box, it says booster packs and other surprises. So we're expecting something special in here somewhere. Just quickly pop this open so you can have a look. Here's the artwork, it's a great picture. And as you can see, it goes 1 to 12 on the left hand side and 13 to 25 on the right. So please stay tuned for this also. All these will be done gradually within the next couple of weeks, so please keep an eye out for these. Until then, thank you very much for watching. Please subscribe and I'll see you next time.